Thank you very much for coming. I really appreciate you making it out here tonight. Uh, it's, I know it's a Tuesday. I know there's it's windy. There's icy cold rain. People have colds. Uh, people are busy. Uh, but I really appreciate you taking the time and being with the, us here tonight. And uh, so a few words about uh, the music itself. I know I say like in the email releases and the flyers and whatnot, it's not exactly jazz, it's not exactly classical. Um, while it is improvised, uh, it is freely improvised. <laughs> Jazz musicians, they work from chord changes, certain structures, certain preset notions, melodies, um, and we don't do that. Everything is completely spontaneous. Uh, it sounds classical in that sometimes it'll sound like some of the 20th century masters like Bartok or Prokofiev or Charles Ives. Classical is not fully notated, so it's completely spontaneous chamber music, essentially. And sometimes it'll veer towards more classical uh, flavors. And sometimes it'll veer more towards uh, jazz flavors. But it's an adventure. It's an adventure in listening. Uh, it's an adventure for us every time we do this. We don't know what's going to happen. <laughs> so thank you for being part of our experiment. If you don't like what happens tonight, it was free, right? <laughs> <laughs> So, uh, so yeah, and then just don't tell me. Just say you like it, you know? <laughs> so what I would like to do is to run through snippets of each of these things so you kind of know what to expect, even though it might not be what we'll do this evening, you know, the specific ideas. Um, but I would like to kind of run the show in microcosm over the next hour or so. I'll tell you, I did a, a little bit of thinking about how we could organize the evening, and I've organized it into some suites. So we have con concepts, very, very basic concepts that we're working from. The first suite is on, um, uh, I called it family dynamics. And so every number will be um, a member of uh, a multiple generation family. So the first number is father, for instance. So, so who plays today, uh, today that first number? They know that they're playing father. And the one directive I gave them was authoritarian. first number, and each one in the next uh, six or seven numbers will be um, a person in the family and have a particular flavor, and different uh, musicians involved in it. Sorry, yeah, piano will start, but there's a couple times where I've asked somebody to start. Is the, is the instrument that is on, uh, is that necessarily going to end it or not? Oh no, not necessarily. Okay, it's so the where... instrument actually could drop out after Oh yes. Said what he in wants fact, to say. in fact, you know, in good, uh, the concerto artist doesn't play wall to wall either. You know, the orchestra takes over right. sometimes. No, that yeah. is quasi concerto movements. So when is this trumpet and all trumpet is the song of the concerto artist? Yes, <laughs> and we're all the accompanists. So everybody has their concerto movement. If it's just all, that means we are all. It's like concerto grosso. We're all equally. <laughs>
color code these things. <laughs> thinking, um, but yeah, that was just a way so that we weren't looking at each other too. <laughs> um, but, you know, being able to see one another is a great thing. I'm fine. If you think a semi-circuit, there's a, if there's enough room to do a semi-circle, yeah, let's do it. playing trumpet for the Alcoa Parent College. son or the daughter, and I'm going to invite a couple more people out. Let's have uh, Tony Grasso come back out for trumpet, and we're going to see Ken French for the first time on drum set. <laughs> So let's see if you can guess what emotion we're going for. So Brad, if you'll come out, I think it's time for you. All right, let's welcome Brad out. <laughs> Yeah. 
Yes. Um, is there a way, maybe it's not as high? And we'll just be, you know, sensitive to your levels. That was, uh, what do you think? Yeah. Oh, sad, yeah, oh. melancholy. <laughs> That's what we were going for. I, I had said to him, deeply lyrical and sad. So let's see if we can get uh, the next emotion. We're going to invite uh, Michael Nicolella uh, out. He's playing guitars for us tonight. Um, he's going to be playing acoustic. <laughs> Michael Nicolola is going to come out on electric guitar, and I'm going to let you guess this uh, emotional state. That's beautiful. Uh, no. <laughs> <laughs> you were in for, yes? <laughs> I think some people, for these, because it's concerto style, they're going to come to the center, but you do not oh. have to. Well, I think look at the end. Well, we'll see what happens. Yeah. I'll be spontaneous. Yeah. Uh, so what do you think it was? Frustration. Frustration? Yeah, that's not what we did. Murderous. <laughs> Sorry. What was it? Murderous. Oh, that's a good one. Um, fear. fear. We were going for something a little bit more G-rated. <laughs> PG, not PG, you know. <laughs> Start it. I'm just gonna, there'll be no piano, I'm just gonna listen. Yes. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. That's what they wanted. It's me and Trey
minute or minute and a half, I, I just had to listen to the group because I thought it was beautiful. I thought it was transcendent and I just didn't want to touch it. I just wanted to sit back and listen as an audience member. It was beautiful. So thank you again and uh, drive home safely. I hope you enjoyed yourselves. Take care.